The database research community has made significant contributions to the field of computer science and continues to exert a strong presence on the industry as a whole. In order to keep up with the fast-paced nature of the industry, a group of database researchers have been meeting every five years since 1988 to do a self-assessment of the community's impact on the computing industry as well as research challenges and opportunities. Surajit Chaudhuri and Magdalena Balazinska are members of this group and contributed to the Seattle Report on Database Research. Over the past five years and even before that, right, so it has been actually quite long in the making that the world has really uh, been transforming and becoming increasingly data-driven. Whether we are thinking of data as the fourth paradigm of science, whether we think of data as the driver for decision-making in businesses, um, this transformation has really been um, happening for a long time and actually increasing and growing. So we have seen already many years ago the emergence of big data or the need to analyze large quantities of data, often doing so in, in public or private clouds. More recently, we have seen large transformations in, in our machine learning and artificial intelligence. And then the second aspect has been that we have increasingly seen uh, the cloud becoming a very, very important part on how, where we do all our computing. And that has created a huge shift from the prior era. And the third thing is the hardware world has not remained steady. It has, it has gone um, and created very, very new opportunities. You have seen GPU, FPGA, uh, they're becoming increasingly important as accelerator as, you know, dinner scaling has slowed down and has ended, in fact, uh, which has caused the importance of this heterogeneous computation uh, come up sharply. The changes from the last five years have significantly altered the database landscape in terms of new research opportunities, and while much progress has been made, with progress comes new challenges. So one of the challenges for our community is that data science has really emerged as its own discipline. What we are seeing is that users today have very different data management needs. So we have data scientists, they work in a different environment, you know, they use Jupyter notebooks to interact with the data, they need to operate with data that's stored in data lakes. So that is really changing how people interact with data uh, and what they are going to do with the data. The second thing I think which is also important uh, is that the hardware, you know, it has become clear if you look at the machine learning and the other world, their reliance on hardware such as GPU has become very important, which sort of makes us wonder that we as a database community, what should we do in this? Should we just say, well, we should just stand by and continue with our classical architecture, or is there an opportunity to take advantage of this? And I think this is at a very early stage for the community. There is there's some work has happened, but there's a lot more for us to do. Uh, we have also seen a lot of challenges around misuses of data, uh, that it's very easy to um, uh, have biases sneak in in algorithms, uh, and a lot of the quality of how we use data depends on the data in itself, really is core to the data management aspects of the data. Although in the early years, the database community could get away with working only in the context of data to solve problems, today, that's no longer the case. Today our community intersects with many other communities, machine learning, data science, the systems community and the hardware and architecture community where we have to sort of work with them to take advantage of different hardware ecosystem. I think there is a pressing need for us to do an outreach to other communities, work with them, identify powerful problems and where we can have the best impact. Learn more in the review article the Seattle Report on Database Research in the August 2022 Communications of the ACM.